All right, let's get started, boys, girls, MBs, fucking gaming enjoyers, and the random politics frogs that are like, oh, shit, let me take a look at what's going on here. Who do you think did this? Think about it. You're Carver. What do you do? Carver. What's the most important thing in this world? By the way, they weren't lying. That Carver, that Carver is a real son of a bitch. Like low key, high key. He, they weren't lying. I thought they were like exaggerating, especially because they're such pieces of shit to me originally that I, I thought maybe they're exaggerating how bad this fucking guy is. He's a real freak, dude. A real freak. A super freak. Clem, it's family. People like Matthew aren't coming back. Fuck you, Bonnie. You bitch. Rebecca, our baby deserves to be raised in a place of safety. Oh! Go to hell, you fuck. Oh, politics frogs. If you haven't left by now, there's also uh, Manhattan District Attorney Alvin Bragg. He's prominently featured in the game. And a big part of our job is to literally save his life so that he can end up prosecuting Donald Trump in the hush money trial. I forgot to mention that. Fuck, dude. Alvin Bragg is literally one of the main characters. Like, it, his home. own name and everything. Like, they use his family. real name. Crazy. Yeah, I made a decision to save his life. Probably a bad one, but stick to my guns like that. Stick to my guns like Alvin. You got done over there? Yeah, one second. Thanks for coming with me. It's scary out here. I know they made you. It's still nice that you came. We're friends. Friends look out for one another. We are, aren't we? Well, if you need to pee, let me know. I'll keep look out for you, too. Uh, I feel bad for Sarah. Okay. She's just a little special, you know what I mean? It's not her fault. Everything come out all right, girls? Troy, get him tied up. That's a we weird question do. to ask, bro. What the fuck? No, we're on Did our you way. Everything come out Probably all right? Like, you're talking about piss? Make sure everyone's prepped. Emotions might be running high. Carve her out. If I find out you've been wasting fuel to keep that fucking heater going, I'll make you walk back. Nope. Froze my ass off. Just like you told me to. It ain't polite to listen to other folks' conversations. Has anyone ever taught you that? I used to have a walkie-talkie like that. Oh, really? And what happened to it? Because you can't have this one. It caused trouble. People got hurt because of that stupid thing. People died. Well, if you try and take this one, honey, I'll hurt you myself. Get the girls in back with the Bro, rest of I'm them. Bro, I'm 11, we dog. Got a bit of a Calm drive the ahead fuck of us. down, dude. Freak. Freak ass son of a bitch. In. Are you guys okay? The hell did he do to you? Hey! Did he hurt you? Hey! Hey! Yeah, chat, don't say I'm 11 in the chat. I, I don't want Twitch to ban you. Oh yeah, Kenny's alive. For those of you who weren't here yesterday. That's Alvin Bragg right there. Manhattan District Attorney Alvin Bragg. Straight up.
All right, we gotta do something. Come on. Anyone got anything sharp? Anything? We need to get these bindings off. Hey, Clem, help me find something to get these off. Anything sharp that could cut these. And what good is that gonna do? The hell is wrong with you people? We gotta get out of here. Why bother? What? How can you say that? Defeatism. I just don't see how it's gonna help. We're in a fucking precarious position here. We gotta do something about Settle that. Settle down, Kenny. They took everything. We have to keep a level head. He's right. You don't know Bill like we do. Bill? This whole time it's Carver, Carver, Carver. Now he's fucking Bill? Oh, I see what it is. Y'all are just getting a ride home, aren't you? That's what's going on here. Say that again. I'd stay out of this, boy. Mister, I ain't a boy. No, right. You're a man. You don't understand. He's different. He's worse. The fuck are you talking about? He wants to punish us. You could have warned us. Yeah, you didn't tell us he was a fucking psychopath. True. You have no idea what you're dealing with. Oh, he gave me a pretty good goddamn idea back at the lodge. And I don't intend to sit around here and let that happen to the rest of us. I'm trying to help. I'm sure Walter really appreciated your help. That's not fair. You're blaming him for the actions of a madman. I am pointing Wait, what the out fuck? that regardless of intent, there are consequences to rash actions. Something that he seems to be misreading as capitulation. I don't know what the fuck you're saying, but I know it's bullshit. We have to do something. Kenny. Damn, Kenny getting racist again, dude. Kenny, Kenny's getting fucking racist again, bro. He's like, I don't understand you, Carlos. You seem to be one of them urban types. You can't reason with him. Oh, shit. Jackpot. Sit down. You're going to get us all killed. Y'all don't know what you're talking about. We get cooped up in some kennel like a bunch of fucking dogs. It's over. You don't know that. Yeah? Well, I've been in this situation before. You ever been a prisoner? Kenny's right. We have to do something. We can't just sit here. How is it the kid is the only one that sees what's going on here? Clem, the adults are talking. Is oh, now I'm is? a kid. All right, now we're talking. Carver will be on the other side of that door with ten people. <laughs> there, there, baby. It's okay. Everything's gonna be fine. At this point, maybe Luke is the only hope we have. If he was gonna do something, he'd have done it by now. Who knows what he's dealing with? Anything can happen out there. I'll tell you what happened. He abandoned us. You don't know that. I know he ain't here. He may not be around, but he wouldn't just leave us behind. Luke will help us. Oh yeah? When? After that crazy fucks killed us all? He won't help you at the top of the hour when there's a three minute ad break. I'll tell you what. That's right. Only God can help you. And by God, I mean subscribing for $5 or for free with a Twitch Prime, baby. That's the only god dang thing that'll help you at the top of the god dang hour. Kenny's yelling at Clem too now. Bro, the further we get away from the boat, the more Kenny gets... The more Kenny gets angry. I feel like spiritually there must have been a boat at the river or something. Like he was happy being at the ski lodge. Because there was definitely like a boat, I assume. That he could just like kind of look at every now and then. Maybe like a boat painting or something. To just center him. And now you are seeing the the consequences of staying away from a boat con fox thank you for the five get the subs here's the three minute right now hey look clam we're close okay let's do this they have guns what exactly do you expect to do i'm gonna punch the first son of a bitch i see then i'm gonna take his gun and use it to shoot the next son of a bitch i see just sit down shut up doc this ain't your call Hey, just, if something happens, just help out, okay? Don't, you know, get yourself hurt or nothing, but any help would be good. Hey, Clem, look at me. You trust me, right? Bro, we didn't even Kenny, get anyone else. Kenny, please, else's. just, just listen to them. They know him. Yeah, okay, I trust you. I'll, I'll do what I can. Am I gonna right. get... It's okay to be a little am scared, I gonna get Kenneth but we killed gotta here? do this. I, I mean, don't spoil it, but... All right, everybody ready? Kenny! Kenny, are you okay? Is he okay? Bro, I think so. he got owned before oh, he got even started. Me. It's probably for the best. 
That's so funny. That is hilarious. Goddamn brakes ain't working for shit. All right, up and at him. Big dog got fucking clapped before he even the began fuck? the process. How'd you get your restraints off? Come here. We've got some familiar faces back with us tonight. Now, I understand some of you are confused as to why we bring these people back when they left us as they did. I think I've got an idea. Now, it might not come all at once, but time will heal these wounds. So be patient with them until it does. Damn, he's so understanding. Knowing that they're here to help us make our home a better place. All these feelings you have of anger, betrayal, hate, they're all valid. Bro, they can't be all that bad. This guy fucking literally has this entire... This guy literally has a phenomenal base of operations. I'm sorry, but clearly he's got the right mindset, okay? That's crazy that he's like... He's doing a better job than the fucking family that I was living with beforehand. No one needs to forget what they did, but we do have to find it in our hearts to forgive them. Look how much food they have. Yeah, they're doing something oh, right. Clem recognizes you too. As many of you already know, a large herd of lurkers gathers just south of us. Come on, we need you for something. Can I wait until morning? We're all exhausted. Just come the fuck on. Turn our way, it's nothing we can't handle. Some I need him. I need my dad. I, I can't. He's... He looks and after me. They have been taken into consideration. However, this is not up for debate. The expansion project will move forward. He'll be back. When? I don't know. But he will come back. Thanks, Clem. Grow up. And There's a lot the of evil Clem options on this. this evening, I have no doubt that we will continue Make sure y'all stay off the fence. Bill can it's save no you from messing enough. with it. Bro, I like tabbing out aesthetically. That's why I don't press spacebar and I tab out instead. Just because I don't like having it say paused. Okay. Is weird to survive it's our obligation to make this community a beacon of hope thanks bonnie yep to provide a light oh you feel bad bonnie light, you bitch fuck you to shine in all this darkness so that is what we'll do y'all best get some rest because there ain't gonna be much for you tomorrow you're gonna be working hard that's for you yeah, it would be. Fucking Bill. Keeps me out in the cold, but at least I'll be comfortable. Hey, guys. Reggie! <gasps> I'm so sorry. He's the one-armed so guy who got bit. What did they do to you? This could have been worse, trust me. I'm lucky to be alive. Oh it's my god! Fault. It's Camille Nanjiani! Oh my god! Bro, there ain't no way. No, it's really not. I would tell you if it was. This happened well after you guys left. I guess I should say Reggie helped to us. See you, but... Yeah, no, chat. I wasn't being fucking racist. I'm saying this prominent actor is voicing the fucking character. You guys are so annoying. Oh my god. You guys are so fucking annoying. You're like, oh, racist. Like, no, dude. It's his fucking recognizable voice doing the voice acting. You're so stupid. I have to go pee. I, I'm going to go pee when you, when you think about your silliness in the chat.
Kaya. Come here. Place. Good girl. When we ran away. I know. I feel the same way. What happened to his arm? I don't know. We were all running out together. But then he fell. And everybody kept running. I know he had both his arms then. They got me working outside. Lurker just snuck up on me while I was hammering something. Luckily, they took the arm off quick. Saved my life. That's awful. I'm so sorry. Look, it was my choice to help you guys. Alvin, Carver wants you in his office. What? Why? Don't make this difficult. It's too late for that. No, please. It's okay, Beck. Just get some rest. If he wanted to do something to me, he'd have done it already. I'll be He's fine. He's gonna call him a cuck. Let's see what he wants. <laughs> Don't kill him, Carver. He hey, needs to Ridge. prosecute oh. Trump. Hey, Troy. Don't go fucking up now. Bill's real close to letting you out of here. You make sure things stay nice and quiet out here tonight, and I'll be sure to let Bill know just how helpful you were. Yeah, you can count on me. Thanks, Troy. Don't mention it. Could have been leave. You made the right decision. No, I literally told you guys that it was too late right. to cut Lee's arm. Let me arm. introduce you. We were with them when we got caught. Hey, I'm Reggie. That's Sarita. Hello. And that's Kenny. Hey. Uh, hello. Who are you? This freaks you out. My name's Clementine. It's very nice to meet you, Clementine. Hey, where's Carlos? Bill's already got him looking at some folks. Oh, okay. Good. What about Pete? Can you guys save it for the morning? Some of us gotta be up early. Who's that? I don't know. I don't recognize the voice. No problem. Sorry about that. Okay, that's Mike. He's kind of a dick when he's tired, but... Like I said, he saved my life, so I put up with that shit. Bill put him to work outside the wall with me. I'm so sorry. Stop with all the sorry. It was my choice. Besides, he said once you were all caught, he'd let me rejoin the group, so I'm glad you're here. I'm just joking. <sighs> I know. I mean, he did say that, but I'm not happy about it. Who's she? Hmm? Who? The girl over there. Oh, yeah, right. Okay, so he she's could never fucking be Lee. weird. They found her sneaking around outside the camp covered in guts and just like the grossest shit. It's probably best not to stare. I know how it must look, but it's really not that bad here. Reggie. No, I'm serious. Where else are you going to find food like we have? We've got the canned stuff and now with the greenhouses coming along, we've got fresh food. The building's getting more and more secure all the time, mostly through forced labor, but that's only temporary. They've even got the solar panels working. When was the last time you had electricity, huh? Well, we just came from a lodge with a wind turbine. It's not a competition. I'm just saying, it's huh. not as bad as you think. Owned. We're building up, something Sarah. great here, guys. A real community. Bill is making it happen. See, Look, you I've can't made argue mistakes, with the results. and he's forgiven me. That doesn't make up for what he's done, Reggie. I know that, but I'm starting to see what this place offers. I didn't before, and with the accident... It's just that much more important now. Carver killed my friend Walter. Okay, I, I don't know what happened. But maybe he had his no, reasons. No, he didn't. He's his reason is he's a crazy piece of shit. Listen, I'm really close to getting let back into the group. Once that happens, I can do a lot more to help you guys be more comfortable. Comfortable? What do you think this is? I just don't want you to mess things up for me. I've worked really hard to get to this point. Will you please just try not to cause any trouble? At least until they release me. Then, once I'm out, I could help you more. Maybe even help get you out. We won't get you in trouble. They're expecting me to keep things in line out here. Well, if Carver's such a great guy, I'm sure you've got nothing to worry about. We can at least talk about it more in the morning. Just have a quiet night and chat again tomorrow. I can't believe what I'm hearing. Look. Mm -hmm.
Is it effing? What? It's not effing on my end. I didn't, I didn't even see it. Fact is, Bill had every reason to kill me when I helped you guys, but he didn't. Obviously, I don't know what happened while you were all gone, but he's given me a second chance, and I know he'd do the same for you. Reggie, I don't want a second chance. Bro, he's dick riding him so hard. I want to leave so with hard. my family. That's it. He's blowing Your bubbles on Carver's dick. He's blowing bubbles on Carver's dick harder than, than she did when she got impregnated by him. I need to sit down. Yeah, come on. To be fair, I don't Sarah, know what the can circumstances you go see if were. Some people had to drink. Okay. Yeah, this water over by the benches. Ah, oh, that didn't go as planned. Should have actually made a plan. Man, fuck that guy. I don't think we can trust him. I mean, clearly he's already drank too much of the Kool-Aid. I like him. Oh, he's a weirdo. You got to take a look around. Bro, you're the we weirdo, Kenny. We gotta know if there's anything we can exploit to get out of here. We're in a tight spot. Gonna have to wriggle our way out. Well, what should I be looking for? Stuff that they don't want us to know about. That Troy asshole's gone for now. This is our chance. Don't worry about Reggie. I'll go help run interference on him. I'm looking for shit? Stuff that they don't want us to know about? Walker Thanks, Kenny. Walker just snuck up on you, huh? Yep. I was uh, distracted, just wasn't thinking. There's all kinds of noise, hammering and stuff. I saw its shadow. It moved in front of one of our work lamps down here and knocked it over. Couldn't even see for a second. That's when it got me. Can't believe you survived. I can't either, honestly. But Mike killed the walker, then took off the arm really quick. Like he'd done it before. Is this stuff that they don't want us to know about? Like this fish statue? KKK, K -K 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 Kenny being raised again? True. Guess it's better than the ground. It's not. I saw a fella try that a few months ago. Just ended up bleeding out. Ended up hey, Clown. Anyway. Nick? Yeah, like I said, it felt Just like thinking about Luke. Just, there's no way he's really gone. Quick. That he left. How about it? Because me... I've known him for damn near 20 years now, and I can't buy it. Of course, I can't on. say the thought never crossed my mind. Come Things here. change. Whole damn world change. Yeah. Yeah, he's still out there. You watch. Why wouldn't he help us before we Naya. got here? I don't know. I just know he's out there still. He's smart. Kenny. Smarter than me, that's for sure. <sighs> Guess I'll try and get some sleep. You should, too. They're gonna ride our asses tomorrow for sure. Okay. Night. My name, so I told her it's Rajiv. Then I just stood there while a guy yelled Reggie for five minutes, and that's when I thought I should really get out ahead of this. Looks kind of crappy. <laughs> oh my God, K Kaya! I said place, place. That's crazy. This girl is out of control right now. Place. No. She's literally rebelling against me. Hold on. Kaya, place. She's mad at me. Look at the, look at the look on her face. How do you read the chat when we go hypersonic mode? I have the human AI. That's how I do it. Places the command for her to 
to stay in the same location or her bed. Hold on, it's getting hot in here. That's probably why she wants to move around. Got to turn back the AC on because it goes into automatic eco mode. No matter how much I fucking try and make sure that it doesn't, these goddamn woke ass libtards. Woke ass AC. This place seems pretty secure. Mm. Hey, Clem, come on. Don't be like that. She ain't doing nothing wrong, Reggie. Just relax. How can I relax when she's walking around touching everything? Wow, good one, Kenny. You really distracted Reggie. Good job, dumbass. Just relax. Oh, okay. Got it. Ouch. Blind playthrough? Yeah, blind. Maybe we can lower that rope. Bro, me being 11 kind of hurts this situation a little bit, don't it? My 11-year-old ass is not store. having an easy time with this. Clementine, please. I asked really nicely. I don't want hey, to... what the hell is she doing? No, uh, nothing. <laughs> you know, kids. They love not listening. <laughs> you had one job, Reggie. <laughs> This is real disappointing. Oh no, Gonna that's have to it. Tell Bill about this. Please, come on. Hey, don't be like that, man. You shut your fucking mouth. I don't know you. Dad! Oh, you all fucked up now. Bill's gonna hear about this shit. Troy, please. Fuck you, Ray. Bro, fucking calm down. I'm 11. I touched the door, okay? Can you fucking cool your goddamn jets, you fucking freak? Jesus Christ, dude. He's like literally Gee, losing this is his mind. You back a few. Get comfortable, asshole. He was trying to help. She's just a kid. No one's talking to you, Indian lady. Hey! Whoa! It's fine. I am Indian. Everybody Whoa! get to bed. Whoa! Okay. We got a clansman. Some of these folks ain't too keen on leaving. It's up to us to figure out a way out of here. You up for it? It's your decision. I'll try. You'll do just fine. Now get some sleep. We'll need it. I'm I'm not invested in leaving. I'm going to be honest. I kind of want to explore the dynamics of this DPRK style labor dictatorship. Dictatorship of the proletariat. That is still operate. Oh my God. He kicked me in the fucking chest. What? Get up. Bill's gonna have a word. There's been increased walker activity along the fence, so be mindful when outside the walls. The herds moved a little closer as of this morning. But that still doesn't necessarily mean we'll be hit. No, we're monitoring the situation. Now... There are some folks might be sore about what happened, and how things went. Well, that's all in the past now. Some of you are new to our community. Some of you are members who went astray. But know that you can find redemption here. Forgiveness by proving your worth through what will undoubtedly be hard work. Now, Reggie slipped up last night, but thank you, little bear, that doesn't for the rain. He should lose hope. Today will be a test for him. So let's all wish him the best of luck. How'd you sleep? I'll let Reggie be an example I'm to you all. So tired. Salvation is available, but it, 
I didn't even realize earned. that. Pay attention. Kenneth will be I'll taking talk over later. Reggie's okay. duties outside okay, the walls. Okay, yeah. Sounds good. Michael will continue on. I showing just thought his it was value. nice to finally. Carlos! Yes? Your child seems to be in need of correction. I'm sorry. I. Sarah, apologize to Mr. Carver. S I'm sorry, sir. God, no, Sarah, no. you fucking that suck. ain't gonna cut it. I can't have this kind of behavior. Dude, oh my god, is he about to fucking beat her up? Because honestly, based. Okay, some kids need it, okay? Some kids need that kind of course correction. Carver's about to deliver. He is becoming better every fucking moment. If you're on day one of your reform, you discipline her now, Carlos. How do you propose that one I... One good smack across the mouth should do it. It'll make her think twice before opening it up again. Go on, we'll wait. That's so psychotic. He's like, yeah, we all have to watch you abuse your child. <laughs> Yo, Carver, listen, man. How else do you think this man put together such a fine-tuned, well-oiled machine? I ain't seeing nobody else in a fucking Costco with AK-47s. I'm sorry. Have you guys fucking seen AK-47s on anybody else? No. Okay. This dude is actually onto some. Maybe you do have to beat your stupid children for for surviving the fucking zombie apocalypse. Wait, I'm not sure with my hand that I. Could. Well, that's why you got two hands, Carlos. Come on, not some namby pammy thing, all right? A good hard smack. Otherwise, Troy here will do it for you. I don't think you want that. He can be overzealous. Is that the word? If it means I'll slap the shit out of her, then yeah. What the fuck? Come on, Carlos. It's my fault. Hey, no one's fucking talking to you. Unless you want one of what she's about to get, I'd pipe down, Missy. What the fuck? Why did this dude say he loves... He enjoys I'm sorry, Dad. hitting children? I'm sorry. Close your eyes, honey. It's only going to sting for a second. That's crazy. He's like, hell yeah. Can't wait to beat the shit out of a child. Finally, some god dang Do entertainment. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Dude, Carlos, bro. You didn't have to fucking. Oh my God. Bro, bro, you knocked the shit out of her, dude. What the fuck? You knocked her so hard. She's going to have Aaron Rodgers style conspiracy theories by tomorrow. Oh, my God. <laughs> you fucking knocked the glasses off her face, bro. Carlos, you were supposed to fucking, you know, give her a little baby tap, dude. <laughs> bro, that wasn't. I'm going to be honest with you. I don't think that was just because Carver told him to do that. Okay. I feel like sometimes we end up getting a little bit of resentment towards our children. <laughs> he was, he knocked, he knocked her out. Like he was, he knocked her out. Like the past, you know, 12 years was frustrating for him. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry, Sarah. Stop! You're not cuddling that girl anymore. Let her sit there and think about what she's done. Troy, get Carlos to his post. Everyone else should have their assignments. It's time to get to work. That's God not how damn. a loving father sees You really knocked the kid. shit out of her, Doc. Everyone get to work. <laughs> Even the fucking perv is like, damn, dude. Have you? Maybe you should reconsider this whole corporal punishment shit. Even the perv is like, God damn, son, you... You fucking, you get, you caught a fade right there. That's fucked up. You trying to abort her or what? Fucking liberals, man. You're working in the armory. Follow me. Soil, coming up. God 
damn this thing! Oh, shit. Clementine! Who is this? She's one of the new people. She was with Carlos and Sarah Ugh, and... Sarah? I wish she'd stayed gone. She's had a hard time, Becca. Oh so my god. Damn, they fucking hate Sarah around these parts, bro. What the hell? Sarah, not very good at making friends. Definitely could take it on the chin, though. We found out. Jesus Christ. We? We're not sitting on the ground like babies. Go on inside. Bonnie's waiting. Hey, I guess you're starting your day with me. Boo. We're Fuck loading you, Bonnie. magazines. Fuck you, Bonnie. Boo. Of course, this is a fucking American grocery store for the European chatters who are still watching, even though it's like fucking 8 a.m. over there. We have bullets in our grocery stores, which is not great when there is no zombie apocalypse, but turns out maybe not the worst. <laughs> When you're in a zombie apocalypse. Well, that's it. You got it. I suppose I owe you an apology. We're Costco I guys. Wasn't truthful of course we can when I came across the lodge, our AK-47 magazine. I was shown a kindness I never would have expected from a group of strangers. But now folks are dead. And I can't help but feel I'm to blame. But the plan was for no one to get hurt. I truly believe that was the intent. I'm going to try to win her favors by saying, "Lo, no, yeah, it's just Carver's fault. It's like, yeah, no, Israel didn't do a genocide. It's just Benjamin Netanyahu. You know what I mean? And then BAM! Turns out you are at fault, Bonnie. Carver's the one who pulled the trigger. He's to blame. Yeah, but I surely didn't help matters. I thought if I was the one that found everyone, I could control it keep everyone safe but that ain't how it went i apologize which don't account for much but it's all i can offer right now you're a real piece of shit bonnie how you know that was your first night in the yard i know it ain't so comfortable you mean my first night in prison it ain't a prison more of a work release didn't they do those in prisons huh. i probably Bro, you were literally nine when you when the zombie apocalypse happened. How the fuck do you know what a work release is at a not as a Wait, nine year old? I don't know. I never been to prison. Don't tell no one. Trying to keep a tough reputation. I was supposed to go. When Luke and Carlos and all them left, I was planning on leaving too. When Luke approached me about it, I I thought he was crazy. I mean we're safe here. We got power, we got food, and Bill, he... He wasn't always like this. Why didn't you? Leave, I mean. If I'm being honest, I guess I chickened out. I justified not going by telling myself it's easier to try and change something that's broken than start all over. Take the situation with the herd? That's the type of thing that rips a community apart. He... Keeps things in line. He's got a lot of this stuff figured out. Nobody's safe here with Carver around. You're safe if you stay on his good side. I would if I knew where it was. I mean, it ain't easy keeping a group this big fed and protected. I don't envy that position. Figured that'd make anyone a little stressed. Oh, I'm, not I'm defending sorry. What he he did. has a little that bit too was... much pressure on him. I'm alive because of him. That's just a fact. He killed Walter only yeah, to know, protect his own people. Walter. Kenny could have killed us all, but he didn't. Bill overreacted. He was in the heat of the moment and he Yeah, let him have a little bit of a kill, dude. Just he's he's under too much pressure. Let him get a kill in, you know what I mean? Just fucking he small overreacted. bean. Luke had ideas about how things should go, but they yeah, didn't line up with moment. what Bill was thinking. They butted heads. Then Rebecca started showing and that only made things worse. Maybe Luke was right about him. I wish he was around, but I just hope he's safe. Hey, Bonnie, is that girl down there? I need to come get her. Yeah, she's here. 
Okay, I'll be right over. I'm sure it's fine. Oh, almost forgot. She's like a worse Nick. No, she's not. She was competent enough to fucking dupe Walter into giving her an entire fucking bag of supplies and then literally lead the rest of the group without getting shot, lead the rest of the group directly to fucking the, the, she's competent. She's not like Nick. I grabbed this for you. Huh? What do you think? I found it at the lodge y'all were at. <clears throat> think it might be for scan. Had to wait for no one to be around to get it to you. It's kind of ugly. Really? I thought it was kind of cute. Fuck well, this you, ain't Bonnie. a fashion show. It'll keep you warm. You better watch yourself. I Clemens Bay, she's like, don't give me this gay shit. What is this rainbow colors? I bet you got this from the Target gay section. It ain't pride, mug. I think some folks might be jealous of that cool jacket of yours. Goddamn liberals trying to make children wear. I'm 11. Why are you making me wear gay clothes? You want me to be gay? Oh, there you are. What's with the ugly jacket? Tavia. What? Never mind. I'll see you later, Clementine. Come on. Follow me. Come on. You see that? Bon is trying to indoctrinate our children. What do you feel about that? That's what I should be saying to her. That should be a talking option. Stay in here for a minute. I'm going to radio down and find out what you're doing. Don't touch anything. That's how I was so discontent in this group. Among the ranks. By hitting them with fucking social issues. Figure out who's on what side of the social issues. And just keep talking about how fucking... I'm going to touch shit. I'm sorry to let you know. Oh, boo. Hey. They put me in here with Sarah. Yuck. Are you okay? I know it's, it's got to be hard. My dad's never hit me before. <laughs> Even when I was really bad. <laughs> he never hit me. He didn't want to do it, Sarah. Carver made him. He's the bad guy, not your dad. So, in a weird way, Carver's the one that hit you, not your dad. I guess so. Carver hit me super hard, because it still hurts like crazy. <laughs> yeah, no, that was your dad, Sarah. You should really think about that. You should think about how the one who gave you life smacked the shit out of you so hard. And just internalize it a little bit. Because <laughs> goddamn, dude. <laughs> That shit was tough. It looked like it. Well, thanks for trying to help. I don't know why people have to be so mean. Like, even when I'm really mad, I still don't want to hurt anyone. Don't mess this up. Yeah, I get it. Reggie's in charge here, okay? Listen to him carefully. Don't mess this yep. up. What are they no going to make Reggie Javier. do? Okay, we gotta do a good job, guys. The camp is counting on us. Come on, I'll show you what to do. It's super easy. Oh, and just so you know, Bill yelled at me this morning for what you were doing last night. I'm not mad, but please, please just listen to me today. I'm on, like, the thinnest ice with that guy. Pick up a pair of those shears. <laughs> Okay, so we're picking these berries, right? Just pick them, put them in the basket. Simple. While you're at it, if you see any dead branches, take those shears and cut them off and stack them neatly for composting. Got it? Hey, so... Is she gonna be okay? Because what happened uh -huh. down there? No. That was straight fucked up. I don't want her freaking out and getting me in trouble. Oh. I'll take care of her. Oh, nice, man. That's your worry? He's like, we just saw not just like corporal punishment on a child, but we saw abuse. And it wasn't just about that very moment. We saw a father try to abort her fucking 
14 year old daughter and all you care about is how this is going to reflect on you Kumail you fucking son of a bitch you don't have to worry good good cause I'm awful at that stuff look Bill's had it out for me ever since I helped those guys escape so I gotta concentrate on my work that Carlos was awkward. Action I won't daughter. do that again. I'm gonna go work now. He did. He fucking he busted out the dragon of Dojima, dude. Hey. Here, watch me. Clem is not respected by anybody. She could burn this place to the ground one hundo p. This isn't that hard, Sarah. I know. I'm just afraid I'll make a mistake. It won't be the end of the world if you oh do. Just God. keep going. You're so fucking oh, stupid. Shit. Oh no. You didn't do any of your work, Clem. Just checking in. See how the new girls are working out. Reggie. Yeah, Bill. Hey. What the fuck happened in here? Look, Bill, they're new and me with my arm. Bro, he's gonna make he's gonna make me, Clem, smack the shit out of Reggie, dude. I see how this guy operates, okay? He's gonna be like, all right, time for you to use this fucking prodding stick on <laughs> Reggie's non-existent arm. Um, it's just not the easy, I just have, I have one shut arm. Shut up, so shut up, shut the fuck up. You better have an explanation for this. And I mean now. Bill, please, just- Sounds just like you were about to give me an excuse when I asked for an explanation. Sarah, she didn't understand. No, nah, this ain't your fault. We talked about this, Reggie. Didn't we? But you just don't get it, do you? Get what? I... I... Oh, no, I'm blaming Sarah, bro. She dumb as hell. She needs to learn, bro. She needs to learn. He's gonna be like, Reggie, smack the shit out of Sarah right now. <laughs> Carver about to be like, Reggie, get over here. Use your one fucking working arm to smack the shit out of her. Why don't you girls wait outside? Reggie and I have a few things to talk about. Thanks for the help, girls. Well, that's where you're wrong. I shouldn't have to hear people. But I do know plenty of people who need to... QTE Clem slapping Reggie. What's wrong, Sarah? Wait, what the fuck? Yo, step away from that lead, Sarah. Wait, what? Is she gonna kill herself? Are you okay? Bro, that took I no, 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 please, Bill! No! No! Wait, no, what? No, please! Ah! Bro, ain't no fucking way. Weakness. Incompetence. It Bro, he just murked him. What the hell? Bro! Yo, this guy, uh, listen, listen, you can hate on the player, but the methods, you can hate on the methods, but the results, I'm just saying, bro, we're Costco guys. Ain't nobody else got AK-47s out here in the fucking wilderness. Okay. I don't know. Puts us all at risk and it won't be tolerated. You think about that. The next time you're asked to do something. Get downstairs. Bonnie's got some stuff for you to do. Go! Bro, they just couldn't... Yeah, someone in the chat said this, but they couldn't hire Kumail for longer than that, okay? Oh, hey. So, they want you to run some supplies out to the guys working at the expansion? 
Real simple. Just take this over to him. What are you going to say about the fucking execution that took place now, Bonnie? Oh, he was having a heated gaming moment again? Was it one extended heating gaming moment, Bonnie? You fucking asshole. That jacket looks real nice. I don't know what Tavia's talking about. Yo, fuck the jacket. What's wrong? Clem? You alright? Reggie. Reggie's dead. What? What are you talking about? Carver killed him. He pushed him off the roof. Maybe... Maybe it was just an accident. What do you mean? Bro, you are such a fucking idiot, Listen to Bonnie. Me. Take this stuff out to those guys and come straight back. Just be safe, okay? Now ain't the time to be calling attention to yourself. I need to go find out what happened. <laughs> so was it a Russian accident? Yeah. Yeah, Reggie just has some bad Hey, Troy! Tea. Clem's just gonna take them boys some nails. All right. Go on. <laughs> hey, that ain't your concern. Get that stuff over to them boys. Just follow them cables. <laughs> Just fucking straight up. Brain is right there on the fucking sidewalk. That's crazy. Bro, they're trying to be Costco guys too. You see this? I ain't nobody's laborer. Fuck that. Let them do this shit themselves if it's so goddamn important. Get your fucking hands off you me, You ain't man. gonna force me to do this bullshit. Bro, Kenny is so racially charged right now. The Get this man in a boat ASAP, bro. I swear to God. KKK Kenny over here. Jesus Christ, dude. Chill, man. I said get your hands off me. Or what? You gonna go tail on me? I'm trying to help you, asshole. Reggie's dead. Carver killed him. What? You sure? Or did you? <laughs> Shit! Fuck! Grab something! Oh, good job. Good job, Kennald. Kennaldinho. What the fuck was... This motherfucker's not dying. I'm holding it. Oh, oh no. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, it said hold A. I thought I was holding A. I was holding a wrong button. Bro, I've lost every. I've lost every QTE. Shit! Fuck it! Grab some. It's not even that. This game is not that hard. It is just like still so hard for me. This dude's got it. I'm a telltale gamer, chat. Oh. Wait, it's not hold A. I think it's trying to get me to. Oh, it is hold A. I thought it was supposed to spam it. Oh, that was so lucky. Come on now. Oh, well, now I'm cooked. There's three more. Oh, use the sledgehammer. Oh, kill him. Oh, kill him. Oh, that's one. I only got one there. Oh, Jesus Christ. I'm so 11. It's not even funny right now. Bro, what is going on, dude? There we go. Get up. Get out of there. Come on. Make me save your ass. Jesus. That dude, I'm 11, bro. I am 11 years old. Oh, thank God. You're okay. All right. Enough mushy shit. You get back inside right fucking now. I'm sure they got shit for you to do in there. Now! Think I'm fucking around? Now I gotta sit down here and babysit you assholes. Can't do a simple fucking patch job without me here cracking the whip? Okay, bro, that is... This guy is definitely racist, by the way. Like, for sure. 
100%. He is big time racist. That thing is going to fall. Oh, what the fuck? Ah, ah, stop. Hey, it's me. Oh, is that Luke? Luke. Yes. Man, bit the hell out of me. I think you drew blood. Come all this way. This is this is the welcome I get. I was worried. We all were. Now it's good to see you too, kid. Hit him. Why would I hit him? All right. Listen, we ain't got much time. Okay, I followed y'all here best I could. I haven't had a night's rest since y'all got nabbed. And, well, that's the first chance I got to talk to somebody. <laughs> They're everywhere. Okay, they got guards watching everything. Shh, shh. There's a herd of lurkers just south of us. It's bigger than I ever seen around these parts. Carver mentioned that. Said he hopes it passes us. Yeah, I heard folks talking about that, but that ain't so. Okay, it's gonna hit this place. I know it is. Now, I don't know when, but it's coming and it's gonna be soon. See, I've been looking for places to, to get y'all free, but I haven't been able to find anything yet. Are you feeling okay? No. No, I mean, uh, yeah, yes. Sorry. I just could use some sleep, you know? Hard to rest when you think a lurker's about to get the jump on you at any any moment. But yeah. <sighs> yeah. I'm fine. Okay, don't worry about me. It seems dangerous. Well, the whole situation's dangerous, but... Well, we're in it now. It's what we got. We just... We just need a plan. You know, a way to get you and... And everyone. Would you take an <gasps> autism test? Yeah, oh, sorry, I took one. Sorry, I shit. beat it. I beat the case, bro. I took an autism test. Okay, Troy ain't gonna like you being late. Listen, Clem, I need you to meet me here tomorrow about this time. Because I, I need you to get me one of those radios, okay? Do you think you can do that? Just just one of those walkie-talkies. I just need to be able to tell y'all what's going on with them guards. You know, I'll figure out the schedule the patrols are on. I mean, they're, they're all over the place, but I can keep an eye on them for y'all from out here. Look, we ain't gonna be able to shoot our way out of here, so we gotta be careful. Where do I get one? I think they keep them in the stock room. I ain't completely sure though. Just keep your eyes out. I'm gonna do this again, but it's like I'm 11. You know what I mean? You're expecting an 11 year old to steal one of the most important pieces of equipment they have? Really? Okay. For the charging station. Now they put most of them back on there at night. Remember, you meet me here tomorrow. I'll try and be here around this time, but if I ain't, just wait as long as you can because I really need one of those radios. And just let everybody know I'm all right, okay? I'm worried they. Uh, Get out where I can see you. Go on. Get out of here. I'm going to say I got scared because there were zombos outside. The hell were you doing? Huh? I was hiding from walkers. Don't go in there, you hear me? That is off fucking limits to you. Wait, why not? Bill Radio wants a word with you up in his office. So get on up there, now. Should a 30-year-old really be talking to an 11-year-old? Bro. <laughs> Bro said, if you're a parent, there's an unjustifiable age gap. There are... I cannot imagine the amount of instances where 30-year-olds talk to 11-year-olds chatter. Like, pretty much most of the people an 11-year-old talks to is above the age of 30. From teachers to... You know, parents, other friends, family members, you know what I mean? <laughs> like. <laughs> Bro said the age gap is inappropriate. <laughs> this is the next level of Zoomer age gap discourse is like 30 year olds should never talk to 11 year olds. Okay. No more parents, no more bedtime. No more fucking teachers. It's how we pass on knowledge as a species. Nah, fuck that. Rebecca. She's a strong woman, surrounded by weak men. I ain't letting my kid get raised around that. Get in here.
Alvin? Alvin! He passed out hours ago. He can't hear nothing. No point in making a racket. Why are you doing this? Me and That's him, the Manhattan District history. Attorney, man. I understand. A couple things we had to get worked out. I wouldn't be so concerned about his well-being if I were you. Not with you being so close to the fire yourself. Now. What? You make sure you tell me the truth when you're sitting where you are. And you won't end up over in that chair. Now, you might not believe this. Bro, he literally pointed to an adult man that he has violently tortured. I'm 11, dog. Do you think that it requires... At any point, do you think there is any point on the planet where you have to tell an 11-year-old you, you are going to violently torture them? After what happened earlier, but I liked Reggie. Hey, gets results. Can't, can't argue with the results, you know what I mean? He was a funny guy. He kept things light. You need folks like that. It's easy to let depression sink in during times like this. But he was weak. And I don't mean just because he was maimed. That wasn't his problem. He was weak of will and weak of character. And we can't have that around here. Not anymore. Not with what we got at stake. He didn't deserve that. Even if he messed up, he didn't deserve to die. Oh, he certainly did. What? You see, Reggie put us at risk with his incompetence. He's had a string of screw-ups lately. Killing one in order to... You know what's kind of crazy? We literally fucking treated Ben this way. Like this community as a whole was celebrating the demise of Ben. Meanwhile, this is what happens when you're devoid of Ben's. Carver is just culling the fucking masses. No Ben's. He has a no Ben policy. You did, Lamount. Okay, first of all, you guys absolutely were cheering. Smoking on the Ben pack. RIP Bozo. Don't act like this. Save many is part of survival. It's one of the tough decisions that a weaker person couldn't make. It's why it falls to people like us to lead them to safety. You understand? Well, I wish it was different. <laughs> I do. But they are weak and we are strong. That's why it's our responsibility to shepherd the flock, to keep them safe. It's their nature to follow. Not He's to making lead. a lot of good points. I know. I have to do everything for them. It's exhausting. Of course it is. But that's the role you're meant to play. And we're more alike than you think. There's no way you could have lasted this long otherwise. I realized it back in that cabin. You were scared. But you looked me straight in the eye. Kept your nerve. That's what we need. If we're going to get through. He's getting awfully close to an 11 year old's face, bro. About to bite that this, nose off, bitch. The next generation has to be stronger than the last to lead us out of this. Kids like you raised the right way. The way my child will be raised. It ain't this herd that keeps me up at night. We can handle that. It's not knowing if I got anyone to hand all this off to. But I ain't worried about that anymore. What if it's not yours? Well, even if that was true, it's mine now. Oh my god. All right, now. Bill, you there? Yeah, I'm here. The loading bay door is jacked. Troy really knocked the shit out of it. How bad is it? Rails are tweaked so it won't shut all the way. I don't think it's an emergency or anything, but it's something Stan should take a look at when he can. I'll get him on it. Out. That fucking idiot. Heard on its way, and he puts a goddamn ding in my door. I'm beginning to understand why Chad said age gap in adult child conversations. <laughs> Carver's not making a good argument. Also, yes, this is correct, dude. 100%. One thing the local man couldn't ruin is the top of the hour ad break. Because many of you are subscribed. So for $5 or for free, because you subscribed, Ben won't be able to ruin your top of the hour ad break. 
Here's the three minute ad break now. Go on back out to the yard. It's almost supper time. Lahad, thank you for the five year to subs. Bro, the kid is dead. Let him rest. Fuck no. Because we all know what happened this morning. I don't know what that son of a bitch is going to do next. So you want to ring the dinner bell for a herd of walkers to show up? How is that better? Because this place will be fucking chaos when that thing hits. No one will be paying any attention to us. He's and right. that's King when we Henry, go. It's 20. our opening. We just got to figure out a way to draw them to us. Your friend here wants to get us killed by lurkers before Bill oh can do God. it. Oh my God. Kanishi, thank you for the 10. Vahati, thank you for the 5. What's happening? Yo, gamers have deep pockets is what I've learned. I should be playing video games way more often, dude. Many more gifted subs come when we're when we're playing video games. Bro, you're on Twitch. It's fucked up. I was wrong. I was wrong with fuck this politics shit. Mivias, thank you for the ten gifted. Oh my god, contraband cloudy cakes, not Christian F. Sheesh. Java Dog, thank you for the five. Kitty Mazov, Jack Frescone nephew, Corso. Yeah, politics frogs. You know what, guys? Between us, the politics frogs are broke. That's why they're always talking about this socialism shit. That's why they're always like, oh, Hassan, talk about socialism again. Talk about socialism. Fucking broke boys, dude. The real ones are the gamers. <laughs> Gaming Andes are like, hey, yo, fuck this socialism shit. I got my money. I don't give a fuck. Zunalar, thank you for the 25 gifted. Moon Bitch Supreme. Om um, J. Atro Curie. Atro Curie. Spike Spiegel. Secret Bummers. Cake Del Bach. Corso. Meow Fao Do. You soon to forget the fact that leftists are broke in general. One of your chatters got suspended for saying they were 11. Yeah, I know. Twitch will clap you for that. We literally have a fucking thing up here. We have a pinned comment. Blast spam. Rectail retaliator. Rectal retaliator. Oh my God, what a fucking name. Mr. Psychopomp. Dick Cheney's attorney. Dick Cheney ace attorney. Jewel Vern. All right, enough. We're going to get back to the game. What is it with you? That's what it sounds like to me. You know that's not what he's saying, but it does sound dangerous. This shit is all dangerous. Kenny, do not speak to me like that. Sound draws walkers. There was this girl, Molly. She used bells to control where they moved. Yeah, that's right. She what had them running all over Crawford. We just need something loud. I got banned yesterday for the age thing. Yeah. Twitch automatically claps you for saying I'm 11 in the chat. So don't do it. Well, unless you've got a megaphone tucked in your pocket, it doesn't help us much now. I still vote we get Luke the radio and wait for an opening. Oh, come on. You know about Luke? He flagged us down when Troy wasn't looking. Told us his plan. Mentioned he talked to you. If Luke can tell us what's going on with the guards, we can use that to pick a good time to escape. That seems reasonable. Who knows when that'll be? Look, Clem had it right. We just need something loud to get their attention. The PA system Carver is always using is quite loud. There's some speakers outside the building, pointed toward the parking lot. I saw them when we were walking out to the work. Troy I like that this guy is now a part of the group, by the way. Like, he's just now a part of, like, who invited you on board, okay? Like, he's just like, yeah, yeah, there's speakers out here. Okay, I don't trust this motherfucker at all. I was always standing next to one of them. I saw the controls. They're in Carver's office. She's right. It's all controlled in Bill's office. There's a switch in there that'll turn them on. How do you know that? 
I used to make a lot of the announcements back in the day. I had it flipped on once. Luckily, there wasn't much around at the time to hear it. It was plenty loud, though. That's perfect. We just got to get into his office. Why didn't you say something sooner? Because it doesn't change anything. This isn't a discussion about how to do it. It's a discussion about whether it's stupid. And it's still stupid. The sensible thing is to get Luke the radio and wait for an opening. You're real difficult to deal with sometimes. Kenny. No, that's all right. You ain't exactly a peach either. Luke's in no shape to help us. You want to put Why our fate both? in that Fuck guy's it. hands, it's not happening. Why can't we do both? Even if we bring the herd to us, it's probably good for Luke to be able to tell us where they're coming from. You know what? Fine. I can get behind that. Okay, so we now get that turn to radio. He keeps us posted on the herd's movement. We fire up the PA thing and bring the walkers to roll over this place. And then what? Get some guns and shoot our way. Bro, Kenny sees a thriving community and is like, it's time to fuck it up. <laughs> you know why? Because there ain't no goddamn boats in here, okay? Let me tell you, if there were boats in this fucking Costco, Kenny would be like, we are not touching anything. This place is pristine, tip-top shape. I'm working with Carver all day, every day until he can let me touch the boats. Classic. Hey, out. I don't know. Whatever we can. We improvise. And that's not a plan. You don't plan to improvise. I figured out what your problem is. You don't think this stuff through. If the end of the plan is just to stroll through a herd of walkers, then you should know from the jump there's no way it's ever going to work. She's right. Actually, I do it all the time. She's going to talk about the guts technique. First words I ever hear you say, and it's just some crazy, stupid shit. Hush. <laughs> what do you mean exactly? When you cover yourself in their smell... Rub the walker guts all over you. I can't tell you from one of them. Now I don't know who's crazier. She's right, Trust though. me. I've walked through herds before. It works. You just have to keep calm and make sure you're good and covered. You seem to know what you're talking about. Lee figured that out. What? It's how we got out of the marsh house. Lee covered me and we walked right through. Really? Holy shit. Oh, good one, Lee. All right, what are we waiting for? Let's get that stupid radio. We still have to find a way to get in the stock room. I got a plan for that, too. Come on, kid. Gonna need your help. Oh my gosh, she's Where a bad bitch. She she's from? a bad bitch, bro. All jokes aside. That's a bad bitch right there. That's a Molly type. We just need to use the winch. She can just climb up from there. Then just drop into one of the skylights over the stock room. There are shelves and stuff for you to land on, so you probably won't fall to your death. Great. That thing breaks all the time. Unless something's changed, it won't support much weight. Come on, up and at him. Don't push her, Kenny. She's our best bet. I mean that, Clem. Of now course, the 11 year old. Don't worry, I'll carry Ask this goddamn girl. team, bro. We gotta get that rope down. Mike, you wanna boost her up? Come on, kid. Let's go. No, I got it. I'll put it. I'll put the fucking team go. on my back as always. You. you already know what this is about, dude. Yeah, we we unlocked the Molly class. We're good. Yep, it's Clement time. Try to hurry, all right? I don't think they're the sharpest guards in the world, but they're no idiots either. They see you not in your bunk. We're all done. <laughs> Shit, he's coming back. I gotta let you go. I can't stand here. Grab something. That's crazy, bro. <clears throat> That's crazy. That's crazy. We're in trouble. That's crazy that he just said, sorry, you're dead. That... <laughs> You're not going to believe what I'm looking at. There's got to be two or three thousand of them out there. In the parking lot? No, not in the parking lot. I can't see them all, but I see the dust they're kicking up. So you're not sure? What, about how many there are? Yeah. How can I be? Fuck. I hope 
hope they pass by us. God, yeah. You think we're ready this time? I don't know. Bill thinks we are. Of course he does, but he thought the same thing last time. We learned a lot since last time. Is it enough, though? We'll find out if they turn this way. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Alarm and sound of doors open. I almost opened that fucking thing. Wait, what am I supposed to do here? I forgot what I was supposed to do. Storeroom skylight? I can't get in there, chat. Some bitch is in there. Assassinate everyone and take over. I, I'm going to do that. Don't you worry about that. That's going to happen. <sighs> Walking like a shrimp. Okay, bro. You need to chill out. All right. With some respect. It's Clemens time. It's crazy about Reggie, huh? Yeah. You think Bill... Go on. Nah, it's just... I was wondering if you thought Bill maybe... Spit it out, Hank. I don't think Bill was gonna let him back in. Huh. You don't? No. Do you? I don't know. Wait, what do you mean? Oh, Bill told him that Reggie wasn't killed. So really? No bullshit. You think we're ready? I think so. The homestead, at least. I'm not sure about the expansion. They're out Bill there. lied to them. Moaning. That's what they do. It's driving me crazy. It's really unnerving. I know what you mean. You figure we'd be used to it by now. I wouldn't figure that. You never got used to a light buzzing or anything? A little different when it's dead human beings walking around. I'll give you that one. So what are you doing tomorrow? Oh, Bill shit. Bill wants me to start getting this bay door fixed. Is that why you're down there? Yep. What Wait, you didn't see again? me? Troy backed into it when we brought the prisoners, the, the new people in. See, it's hard not to call them prisoners. Anyway... I'm looking at it now. I don't think we have what we need. Jesus, really? We repurposed a lot of shit to get this place built. I can't say for sure if we even had the materials before we started expanding. Oh, shit. I don't know about you, but it seems like we really shouldn't be doing this yet. Shouldn't we just wait Turn around. we need more space to make more space? I don't know, Hank. Bill's got a plan. Look, let's no, say we it. call it for now. We'll talk later. No. All right, talk to you later. Yep, later. Ow. Oh, I'm Ow. fucking cooked. Where's she going? Oh, hell no. Oh, no. She's going to see me. Oh, never mind. I'm so good. You can't be smoking back <gasps> here. Vince, come on. Don't give me that. If Bill smells a whiff of smoke back here, he'll flip. What are you thinking? You know what? I'm just going to tell him. I'm not letting someone else get blamed for this. That's bullshit. That's crazy, bro. Yo, oh, no. Vince. Vince, come on. Vince. Dude, what is happening? We got Laratas everywhere in the fucking crew. <sighs> this shit is fucked up. Psst. You get him? Okay, jump down. I got you. He does not got me. I don't think he got me. Okay, never mind. He did we get me. Let's get in bed. Troy will be back any minute. Well? Got him. Should have played Everybody the DLC shaking my head. No, no need drawn suspicion. That was so cool. Thank you, Clem. I told you, you probably wouldn't die. Nice job. She's the only good one in the group. It was nothing. Sure it was. 
Anyway, get some rest. I thought about Duck today, about his dumb little face. First things that come to mind are always the dumb things he was doing. Damn, bro, don't all... own your fucking son like that. That's crazy. Fucking dumbass duck. <laughs> I mean, he was. He sure was dumb. That boy was dumb as hell. Always running in circles. Every damn place he went, he just... Bro, Sarita's literally like, okay, enough. Like, I don't want to hear about this fucking stupid kid that you had. <laughs> Run. He couldn't stop him. Makes it harder to remember he was... A good boy. Well, long day tomorrow. One long day. <laughs> Duck is a fast kid. <laughs> Fetal alcohol syndrome all right, kid. We're all here. That's fucked up, chat. Someone's got to get the radio out to Luke. What's the problem? We should probably figure out who's doing what before we. I'll be honest, Duck's a fetal alcohol syndrome kid is what we used to say, but I've seen way worse. I've seen way worse uh, from this, from the, the groups that I've been a part of since then. So Duck seems phenomenal in comparison, okay? Time to get up. Daylight's burning. They let you sleep in, all things considered. Where's my dad? He's where the rest of you are going, to work. Rebecca, Nick, Sarah, Jane, if you got to take a piss, do it now. The next break won't be for a while. Troy will be coming up for the rest of you. Why just them? Like I said, Troy's coming for the rest of you. All right, look, if we're gonna do something, we have to do it now. And if Luke's all we got, and we pair up with him. I can do it. Where's the meeting? Mike. Yeah? Clementine should do it. Are you fucking kidding? I'm sorry. Who got the motherfucking things to begin with? Me. Oh, now I'm 11? Really? That's kind of fucked up, dude. Because before, you didn't have a hard time thinking about how 11-year-old I was when you were like, yep, sorry, about to drop your ass. No offense, but come on, that's crazy. She's a kid. Why would... There's a million reasons. She knows Luke. She can hide. She got the damn radio for us in the first place. Who cares? And I'm sorry, Mike, but I don't know you from fucking Adam, all right? And if I'm trusting someone to do something this important, I'm trusting her. Kenny's right. I should do it. Don't do something stupid just to get some respect. She doesn't need your respect. Give me the radio. All right, little chickens. Let's get to pecking. All right. And don't think today's going to be like yesterday. No way. No shenanigans. This rooster's going to be surveilling your ass every second of the day. You hear? Got that? I'm afraid I need an answer, girl. I heard you, okay? Good. Come on. Oh, you have your pockets all out. Gonna get your tags all snagged on something. Oh, let's go. Thank God he's... Thank God he's stupid. Because Kenny did not play that off well at all. Hey, she's with me? Oh shit, I almost forgot. Like, let me put stuff in your pockets. Of course, it's definitely not a radio we stole from you. Yeah. Well, take her then. I don't care. Bro, what wait, the wait, fuck? What's going on? Never mind. Just chores of a different sort. Come on, city mouse. That's crazy. Can't you cut her a break? She'd really rather keep with us, people she knows. What? What are we doing? Don't worry about it. Come on. I just wanted to make sure you were all right. I didn't believe you when you told me about Reggie. 
I ran and found Bill once I left you. Figured even if he had done it, he'd make up some sort of excuse, but Bill was just so matter-of-fact about it. Like he'd pulled up a weed or something, like it had to be done, and that was just one of those moments when your blood runs cold. Goose pimples up and down your arm. Cause it turns out the person you thought you knew was never there. You look anxious, Clementine. Something the matter? I do not trust Bonnie at all because I remember the rest of the campers talking about how Reggie left. And she doesn't know that I know what Bill told the rest of the camp. I think Bonnie is a, a bad person. I think she is acting like she's on my side, but I don't think she's on my side at all. I think she is the most ride or die uh, Carver friend in this group. You know you can talk to me, right? I was dishonest when I first met you, but I swear on everything holy that'll never happen again. I... I need to talk to Kenny. Do you now? Wait, my antenna is sticking out of my... I can understand you're uncomfortable. Bro, antenna is sticking out of my pocket. Oh my god. The antenna is literally spit... Oh, dude, it is sticking out of my front pocket. What is happening? Oh my god, I just saw that. I won't force you to be around me if you don't want to. Go on, back out, and be with Kenny. There you go. She's not trustworthy. <laughs> Why didn't you stay silent? What? Bro, are you kidding me? I was trying to get to fucking where Kenny is. They just gave me a major hurry that opening. shit up. I hate babysitting you assholes. Luke? Don't yell. Luke, are you okay? Exit? Luke! Oh Where is he? Luke! If you're hiding, come out! Oh shit, this motherfucker's back there. Oh, I'm hiding. Luke! Bro, I'm just yelling with dudes outside. Are you in here? I think he's just sleeping, right? It's safe to come out. I swear to Christ you're gonna regret this! I was... You ain't supposed to be out here. You people been here one fucking day and already you're fucking up. Well, you wait and see what happens. Move! Hey! Dude, he needs to die. And judging by the Get track record there. of games like this, he's not going to die and how yet. is it that we're repaid for our trust? With treachery? With deceit? With theft? What's going on? I don't know, Clem. Whatever you were planning is over. It's done. You can't just run from your problems. You can't just up and leave when it gets tough. Because there's nowhere else you can go where it ain't. Tough is all we got now. Get that through your fucking skulls. Luke here, he can't help you now. You gotta help yourselves. You gotta help me find the strength to forgive you. Now you can start by telling me where the other one is. I'm gonna count to three. If that radio ain't in my hand by then, we'll have to make things more difficult. He's going to kill Luke if I don't fucking what? give the radio up, right? I feel like he's going to kill Luke if I don't give up the radio. And I... Two. I found it. It's right here. I got it. It's 
It's all right. Sorry about that. Not sure what I was thinking. Three. <laughs> Fucker. No! Oh, God! <gasps> Jesus Christ! Stop! Stop him! Somebody stop him! Troy, do Let something! Let me go! Stop. Clementine, help you me! You have to do this, Bill! No! Stop it! Kenny! <laughs> Kenny! Oh, oh my God! Shit. <laughs> Knocked my ass out, dude. Bill! That's enough, Bill! Please! Bill, there's a breach! Alright, everyone come one with more. me. Bonnie, you stick around. Make sure these folks don't get into any more trouble. Yeah, okay. No supper for y'all tonight. Maybe an empty stomach will give you some perspective. And we'll try this again tomorrow. Do your best with him, Carlos. You need to get him able to move, because we're leaving tonight. We're leaving tonight. I don't trust Bonnie still. I don't fucking trust her. Uh, ow. Dang it. I still don't trust her. Dude, I'm Young Metro. Call me Young Metro the way I don't trust her. I will shoot her. We still don't trust you, Bonnie. See that? What'd she say? She said That's she can get us out of the pen if we can get the PA system going. Second she hears it, she'll run over and spring us. That's great. It's not great. What are you talking about? Look, I know part of this is my fault. I, I, I know. Can we even trust Bonnie? We got no reason not to trust her. I mean, if she wanted us caught, we'd be caught. But tonight, tonight is risky. It is pretty damn risky, guys. Risky? Did you see what that son of a bitch just did? Look, the plan works. Nothing needs to change. And it's all set up. The hard part is done. This guy's fucking crazy. Who knows what he'll do next? Yeah, but now we're dealing with a guy beat to shit, Sarita in no shape to do anything, and I'm a goddamn mess. Look, we should rest up. Okay, we should bide our time, and we should wait for an opening. Bonnie's agreeing to help us tonight. And that doesn't mean she can't do it some other night. Well, he's I don't right. Know, guys. Luke's making sense. Maybe we should wait. We're not waiting. Ain't nothing out there, guys. Trust me, I looked. There's no food. There's no supplies. They picked everything clean. I'm just saying we gotta be sensible about this. Where's Kenny? Doc's over there working on him. And don't look good. <laughs> he's not gonna make it. <laughs> He got his ass beat too hard. He's dead now. <laughs> is he gonna be okay? His orbital is crushed. I don't think there's much hope for the eye. Oh, I got dude, it as he's stable look as sick. I could. Cleaned it. Got some of the swelling down. Bandaged he's gonna look sick with the eye patch, though. Think about that. Until he wakes up, we won't know if there's any damage to the brain. <laughs> Fuck. Okay, look. Maybe I'm just playing devil's advocate here, but if... Damn it, if y'all are serious about going tonight, then we're gonna have to start talking about maybe leaving some folks behind. Damn, Luke's already no! talking about leaving Kenny There's behind. There's no other way. This is bullshit. Well, I don't like it either, but guess what? It's where we're at. Kenny and I are only here because of you people, and now you intend to leave us behind. No, we're not leaving Kenny. That's not fair. We stay together. Life ain't fair, Clem. We're just trying to make the best of a bad situation here. She's an anti-white racist, bro. Her name is actually not Sarita. It's Syra. Like that woman who makes white ladies pay her five grand a pop for racism dinners. That's who she is. She's anti-white racist. That's why she say you people. Syra Rail. Yeah, I, I, I clocked her, dude. Alvin Bragg, Syra Rail. We got all of our faves in this in this game let's to leave kenny good because he won't have to a 
I'm all right, hon. We leave tonight. Plan and I'm sick because I got my vision. I got my fucking sick new look. He's one-eyed. He's lacking peripheral vision, but hey, guess what? Change. He can see clearly. Not bad, old man. Thanks, asshole. You are one tough bastard. Do tough bastards get their ass kicked in front of everybody? You all right? That wasn't your fault, okay? It's all right. The hug him options are the All only right. times that well, I'm like now? actually 11. Every other option is like be a manipulative bitch and, you know, be a, the only reasonable adult in the room. That's why I always take the hug him options because like you just got to remind the game and everyone else watching that you are literally 11 years old. <laughs> Every other circumstance, I'm behaving like a 30-year-old. We get the hell out of here. Like now, now. Yes. Where are we going? In case things get squirrely and we gotta make a break for it, we need a place to meet up. We could meet out at Parker's Run. The hell is that? It's a Civil War site a few miles north. Tourist trap. Got signs all over. Just follow the road. We stopped there after we escaped the first time. Luke and Carlos know where it is. It's not that far. Well, at least if a few folks know where it's at, it'll be easier to find if we're split up. All right, that works. Then we just need someone to go set off that PA, right? I mean, you never bother to explain who's supposed to do that. Shut up, Luke. Oh my God. Okay. Why is everybody looking at me? Hello? Hello? I just did the hugging. Do you remember? Wait, wait, hold on. She's the plan? I'm going to need a boost. Be sure to remember to Dude, the they didn't even, for the outdoor Bro, they didn't even have to say nothing. They just looked at me and everyone knew exactly what was going on. Okay? Everyone collectively agreed in that moment. Oh, of course, let's send the 11-year-old. That's crazy. Speakers. Just the indoor speakers might not draw the herd. It's right on the microphone box. Right. By default, it's set to play music. So you should just have to turn it on, right? Then climb back up and drop into the stock room. We'll meet you there. Down into the office, outdoor speaker switch, turn on PA, up to the roof, down into the stock room to meet you guys. That right? Perfect. I don't remember any of those steps. I already forgot. I'm 11, Be by careful. the way. Hey. Clem, make sure you bring Alvin. What? Yeah, no, he's fucking dead. Fuck you mean bring Alvin? I'm sorry, Manhattan Manhattan District Attorney Alvin Bragg is fucking dead, okay? Ain't no hush money trials are happening. Alvin! Fucking Alvin and the chipmunks ass over here. That's crazy. Are you okay? Bro is dead. He's about to turn zomboid on me literally right then and there. Okay, now the mic. What? What's wrong? No, no, no. No, where are they? Fuck. Is he going to be in there? Where the fuck are the CDs, bro? Are they not on the desk? Oh, wait, they're right there, aren't they? Aren't they under the desk? It's 
not letting me re oh there it is that's crazy come on come on please work this fourth of july make sure your backyard barbecue is complete with how's full line of products to meet your grilling needs Oh, fuck. What? What did they do to you, Alvin? Carver talks all that tough guy shit, then keeps the tiniest gun in the universe. <laughs> There's something funny about that. You have the project. We have the know-how. How? Come on. We have to go. I ain't going anywhere, but you are. Go on. I mean to get some payback. No, we're leaving. We're all leaving. I ain't fit to move, kid. I've, I've run out of rope. Shut up, Clem. Alvin, do it. Let's take no, one for the I'll team. No, I'll just go up there and shut that thing off. You gotta get out of here. They'll be here any second. Thank you. That's Manhattan District Attorney Alvin Bragg girls. to you. I get the feeling it's, it's gonna be a girl. Just a hunch. Go on. <laughs> that baby is. Oh, dude, you took that L so oh. fast. Okay, never mind. Oh. Take his gun, Alvin. Oh, Alvin's gonna turn Zomboni. That's smart. From charcoal briquettes to propane tanks, House has all you need to make your day special. You want to disrespect me? Fine. You want to throw away the life? I'm trying. Bro, there's fucking zombies outside, and this dumb fuck is more worried about killing his own prisoners, dude. Oh my god. So many. Damn, so many people showing up with a discount. It's analogous to capitalism. We're all mindless consumer drones. You know what I mean? We're all zombies. Got a bill for us all. It's fucking fine. You want to run off with this dog shit group of crippled fucks? Then fine. Wow. Be my guest. That's ableist. But I will Canceled. put a bullet in you and that baby. Oh, fuck. Before oh, my God. <clears throat> Assassin's Creed style, bro. Let's go. Get back. Spray him, dumbass. What are you waiting for? Come on, Luke. This ain't none of your business. Bro, are you where? kidding me? Why isn't Alvin with you? Where is he? Bro, spray his ass. What is this argumentation that we're doing? We ain't got no time for no back and forth. Spray Rebecca, him. I am. Oh, God. I am so sorry. Spray Show him, me. bro. Stop asking. Stop saying sorry. Spray and pray. Rebecca, Rebecca, sweetie. My God. How did we get here, you and me? Oh, my God. Kill him. Kill him right now. Kill him right now. Kill him right now. Luke. This is just a bit of a custody battle we got on our hands here. Just shoot him. What? No, I don't. Kenny did what needed to be done. He's got a gun on his hip, bro. Come on, pop him. Pop him. Pop him. Pop his ass, bro. He's got a gun. He's got a gun on him. Did he forget that he has a gun on him? Let's go. Go Let's go. on and wait outside. He's gone. He's gonna enjoy this. Okay, Kenny. Kenny, please. Ken Aldino, let's fucking go, baby. It's Kenneth time. I only need a minute. Go Ooh, on. Take him to you church like to Hosier, this. Kenneth that Copeland. girl's already seen more than you can imagine. Shut your mouth, Bill. You're all just gonna let him do this? Yes. There ain't one part of that son of a bitch I don't hate, but that does not make this right. I'm not going anywhere. Yeah, I'm gonna watch. It's gonna get messy. I know. Yeah, Look Dark Clem arc. Fucking ingrates. I don't even know how good you got it. That's all right. You'll learn. Lambs to the slaughter. No shepherd to guide you. 
No, they got Clem, Clem baby. Clem knows exactly what I'm talking about. Come on. Come on, Clem. Fucking big man now, huh? Le oh, come on, Clementine. Don't be like that. Don't run away. You know you want to see the show. No, I don't want to see it. Who do you think you're fooling, huh? I know you. I know who you are. Let's go. Yeah, go on. Let the sheep out. No, I want to see it, but I don't think an 11-year-old should watch Kenny fucking carve out my man Carver. Okay? You want to know why? You want to know why? Let me tell you why. Okay? It's because the dynamic between her and Kenny might change. The pen. We'll see how long that lasts. I'll be right there. You won't see anything. That's funny. Coming from you. How's that eye? Just follow my voice. It'll get you there. You got a thick fucking skull, Kenneth. Should have put you out of your misery right then. Now look at you. You're a mess. I like that there's a zomber invasion. We didn't cover ourselves in guts, did we? That's not the Kenny I know in there. I wish I thought I could save him. Sarita, stop being a pussy. Nah, nah, I'm, I'm, I'm all right. Come on, we got enough to worry about. Oh my God, Man, Sarita. We're never gonna make it through this. You kidding me? If Clem can handle it, you can. Shit. Wait, we I didn't. I they were coming from the south. They did. Looks like we're in the eye of it now. Bro, what is happening? This is. We didn't even cover Here. ourselves in guns. I'm gonna need something. Thanks. Oh, there it is. You guys better hurry up and get to smearing if you want to live. Or you can die here. It doesn't matter to me. Do it quick. We need to get covered before the rest of them get close. Oh no, she's so stupid. I'll go first. You're gonna put that on yourself? Oh my god, Sarah, you're we so fucking to, Sarah. stupid. Sarah Huckabee Sanders, you better fucking put yourself in some guts right now. You better put okay. some guts on you now right you now, Sarah, you dumb around. fuck. Smells gross. Oh shit. Everybody shut the fuck It'll up. Be okay, get honey. Just stay still. Uh, are you sure? I'm sure. There's nothing to fear if you remain calm. I'll keep you safe. Hurry the fuck up. Turn around. I'll get your back. We already got the bag. Oh, my bag. We ain't got all day here. Everybody ready? They're almost on us. What in the actual fuck is going on here? What is this sick shit? Someone say something before I start. Hey, 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 hey! Don't you even fucking think about it, motherfucker. I will end you, you hear me? Troy. Troy, we talked about this. What? The fuck you talking about? I told you I wanted to get out. You said you'd help, then I'd help. I thought you meant get out of the pen, not whatever the fuck this shit is. I did, but now we can leave. Troy, you can come with us. What? Well, where would we go? Away from here, together. Man, She's so you good. smell really bad. You gotta get a bath before we- Come on. Don't that's, make she's such a bad bitch, bro. She is such a that's a Molly. I clocked her. I clocked her from the jump. God damn, she's such a bad bitch. That's fucking sick. Yo, with the dick shot, that is see, that's rad fem shit that I'm fully on board with. Okay. Sometimes. Some some of these some of these men ain't shit, okay? Some of these men are trash and they do deserve to get their dick shot off before the zombies eat them, okay? Queen shit. Any noise, got it? They might hear something they don't like. And for fuck's sake, walk. Act like you belong, and you will belong. Get over here. 
Oh, Sarah's gonna fuck this up. 100%. 100% she's going to fuck this, this up. Yo. Is that Tavy? Where's Bill? We need him up here. Stay calm. Bro, what? I, I might get shot. It'll be okay. Don't run. Watch Sarah. Quiet, honey. Clementine, come help me. Calm her down. Please, just say something. You're her friend. I don't like that responsibility. Oh, fuck. Okay, that's not the worst idea. That wasn't the worst idea, to be honest. She ran. Wasn't the worst idea, right? <laughs> Look, if she made it, she made it, you know what I mean? Respect. Oh, fuck, she just got bit. I'm chopping her arm off. Oh, Sarita. I'm chopping your I'm chopping your arm off, girl. Baby girl, your arm about to get chopped off. Chopping, get the chopping. Do it. Ah! Oh my god. Ah! Yep, no other way to do it. Let's go. Keep walking. Ah! Keep walking. Bro, what do you mean? That's it? That's the end of it? That's crazy. Bro, I literally saved her fucking dumbass life. What the fuck is she complaining about? Sarah's glasses. She's gonna get someone killed. If I had said I had the radio, Carver might not have been as... As vicious to... Don't ever think that, darling. No telling what that asswipe would have done to you. So how's it look? Am I still gonna be pretty when this heals? You need to get past that walker without drawing all the others. What are you gonna do? Not now. Not now, Dad. Wait, they ain't showing Sarah up in this group now. Did she die? Where the fuck is Luke? Wait, they're not showing if Sarah survived all gonna die, Sarita. Don't let them pull you down with them. Survived it or not. They're not showing Sarah either. Okay, help Sarah with her chores. 54.4%. Told Bonnie about Luke. 63.5% of players chose to hide Luke's presence. Admitted to stealing the walkie-talkie. 66. Watch Kenny kill Carver. You and 51% players left with Sarita. Chopped off Sarita's arm. 57% of gamers were real gamers. You know what I'm saying? They were real fucking gamers, okay? None of this, none of this pansy bullshit, okay? Sometimes you got to get the chopping, boys. That's that gamer ultra instinct, baby. And no, it's not Uno Mas time. I know many of you are saying Uno Mas por favor, Uno Mas por favor. But it is eight hours and I'm tired, okay? I had a long ass day. I had a long ass day. I'm gonna take a shower again. Chill the fuck out. And I will be back tomorrow better than ever, okay?